It's best to list your domain on an established platform since you don't have to worry about drumming up leads. GoDaddy Auctions, Flippa, and Cedo are all great options. Each require some sort of paid option to list, whether it be a membership for GoDaddy, a listing fee for Flippa, or a listing fee and commission for Cedo. eBay actually has a domain name category too if you prefer, but for this example, we'll be using Flippa. The first thing you'll need to do is create a Flippa seller account. Head over to the homepage and click on the sell now button. You'll then be prompted to enter your domain name. Then confirm that you're looking to sell the domain by clicking on the let's go button. This will redirect you to the registration screen. Enter your information and click on create my account. Once you confirm your email address, Flippa will redirect you to a four-step listing wizard. On the first screen, start by writing a tagline and a description for your domain. Next, scroll down to specify how you want to sell your domain. In this case, we've selected auction. You'll also need to supply how long you want the auction to run. The default is 14 days and the maximum is 30 days. The starting price, the reserve price, which is the minimum amount you're willing to sell it for, if the top bidder does not meet this price, the sale will be canceled. And a buy it now price, if you wish to let buyers purchase the domain before the auction is over. You could also choose whether to show the reserve price on the listing, and when you're ready, click on the next button. Here you can select whether you'd like to upgrade your listing to include promotions, such as a featured spot on the site. Otherwise, the listing fee is $10. Enter your info and then click on pay now. You'll then have to specify how you want to receive money in the event of a sale. You could use PayPal or Flippa escrow. With the latter option, the buyer will have to send their payment, which will then be held securely until you deliver the domain. Finally, you'll have to verify that you own the domain you're trying to sell. This could be done via email or by adding a DNS text record. After you've completed the listing wizard, your domain will be put up for auction. When the auction is over, you have to transfer your domain to the buyer. The process varies a bit depending on who your registrar is and if the buyer is using the same one. If you have the same one, it should be very simple once you get their account info. If you have different ones, they need to request a transfer from their end. If you get stuck at any point, contact your registrar or Flippa. And that's it. Now your domain is sold. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to give it a like and subscribe for more content. With that said, thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next one.